All right, welcome back. We are on to turn two, or turn four, actually. But what I want to do is I want to go over with a few mistakes that I had made. Nothing, I mean, it could have made a difference, but a few things I wanted to go through. Uh, first of all, I was supposed to, as long as your morale here is above a one, or is above a ten, you get a plus one. Now, I don't really think that would matter too much. Most of the ones I lost were more by, by more than one. I'm not too worried about that. Uh, so there's that one. The other thing, and if you notice, I moved this up, was when you actually take control of a heavy urban area, which I did here, you actually do get plus one on the morale on that. So that's really cool. So that's uh, so I fixed that. Um, the other thing is, is if you, for the re, uh, Reinforcements that come in, they can only come in on one and two. If there's people in there, you cannot overstack. Now, I did, and apparently, according to the designer, there's about a 2% chance of that happening. And guess what? I'm that 2% chance. What I've kind of what I think now is going forward, I would actually go ahead and focus on these instead of down here uh, with that. The other thing, first round, you get a minimum of 16 supply points, but I did correct that one. That's not a problem. But also, uh, it is a no result on turn run for a couple of the um, random event charts. So specifically, the 60 uh, logical pauses are no events. Um, the 66th event go breakthrough and the 64th. Those are considered no events on the first turn. Uh, everything else is is going as planned, and and it's perfect. Now I'm doing a couple of like I said I was doing a couple of this uh, this uh, um, optional rules, and a couple of the op optional rules show that uh, the one that I am playing is isolated. Now I believe this guy is almost isolated if it wasn't for this unit right here. Uh, because I'm still considering this one. It's not German controlled. So, and there's, uh, if I read it, trace through isolated, isolated, um, a valid supply line is contiguous route of any lengths trace through any Soviet controlled areas. This is a contested area. It doesn't say anything about a contested area. So maybe, maybe not. Um, that's the thing with optional rules. I'm going to play it as it's harder. So, but what ends up happening is an isolated unit would get one of these isolated markers on it. And then when you go to uh, attack, there's a chart here you roll on. It can go anywhere from increasing the defensive factor by one to decreasing it by two. So that's that. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's get started. We're on the turn four. We are on the dawn phase and we do check for isolation. Now, pretty much so, although it's a roundabout ray, this guy could go all the way through here to get to the Volga. So he's not isolated. He could still get his, his um, areas. Now, the key, what would be a key thing to do is to take this piece right here. This would be isolated. That would help me out a lot. But nothing's isolated on that one. So let's continue on. So we have the dawn phase. Uh, we don't have any reinforcements yet, and we don't have the withdraw. So then we're on to the random events phase, and now we'll check and see what happens here. Hopefully my die rolling is better today than it was two days ago. So we have 10. So we have 8 and 2 is 10. 10 is commissars. Increase Soviet defense values by 1 this turn. Ah, that's not what I wanted, but it is what it is. Um... And honestly, I don't see too many that are actually a positive on these uh, rolling on that one. Okay, uh, random events. And now supply phase. We roll 
It says four. Let me just make sure I got that right. Yep, 4d6. Total them up. I guess that'd be right. So we have a total. So let's make sure. Yep, 46. So we have nine. So we get 15 supply points. So 15 supply points. Well, we're going to spend three of them particularly to increase my German morale. One, two, three. Let's see, because I had 15, so this will bring it down 12. And that'll put this up to 11 that way, because the morale is extremely important. I do get one free air support, or one free air. Okay. Uh, I'm going to need some engineer supports, so the air is the free air. Give me two free air. Give me two airs. So one, two, and three. And then so I have nine. So we're going to take as many engineers. So that's three engineers. The engineers are two points each. Keep dropping this. Two points each. So that's six, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll throw an arty supply in here. That'll be two. Oh, the arty's one, so I can do three arties. Here we go. Okay, all set. So I have my support here. And we're done with the supply phase. So then we've got a contest right here. So please, let's just roll a one to four. One to four would be nice. Of course, I rolled a six, which means these guys all flip and they're spent and I lose them around. And I think that's the only one that is. Oh, nope. Up here. These guys uh, need to roll for this one. Got a two. So there's no effect on that one. All right. Oh, well, now it's time to start attacking. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to move these three into here, as well as these two into here. As, oh, I can only do four. I can only have four in there. Oh. Yeah, we're going to throw that one in there. We're gonna also going to put a engineer into here. Um, and I got to add one to theirs. So we're also going to send an Artie in here as well. So they're going to have, they're going to be a 10. We've got two, four, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's 10 to 10. Yeah, let's just do that. 10 to 10. And we're going to roll 2d6 now. The heroes and stuff don't matter. And this is just as bad. I would have 11 because of the one for the morale. And I rolled a three. So he's got 19. I have, or he's got actually got 20. Well, I have not that. So lead unit was this guy here because it's a three. So that's the lead unit. I was, was supposed to do that ahead of time. These go here. These guys go back to where they came from and they're spent. And. And, and now this isn't good because this guy does go up here for the loss of morale. Sorry about that. Okay. Um, trying to figure out where I want to go with this. Well, um, I think we're going to go after this guy all the way up there. So these three are going to move into here. And this guy's going to go in here. He's going to be 11. Now let's send an Aaron here. 
The reason why I'm doing this is because that would isolate these guys for next turn. Um, so we'll do air support. Uh, I got four, five, six, seven. And then... Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I'll have a twelve, and he'll have a, an eleven. Oop! I got do got to roll a one d six minus six. So he's actually at a five. So I should take this one, but let's find out what happens. So I have eighteen or eight. He has ten, so he has fifteen, and I have four. Five, six, seven. So seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, so I do win this one. Okay. Which is awesome. So I do win this one. These guys will go back up here. This guy is destroyed. And then I get this one right here. Oh, I was at minus one, but that's still, I still made it. Control is up to 18 now. And these guys are spent here. I guess I'm going to have to be a little bit more specific. I need to get it up to 40. I still think I can do it. I still think I can do it. Okay. Um, I'm going to move this guy in here. Oh. So I move this guy in here. And... So he is going to be seven. I'm going to have seven, eight, nine, ten. Minus one is a nine. So I have a nine. Let's go ahead and throw an Artie in here. So seven, eight, nine, ten. Minus one is nine plus two. So I have an 11. And he has a seven. So... 7 plus 6 is 13. I'm... Oh, 13. I have 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. But minus 1 is 14, so I just barely win this one. Oh, just barely win that one. So that means this one is... These are all spent here. Oh, I would add a plus one because they were all the same. But anyways, I won either way. So I do get another one of these. And I'm up to 19. Okay, so I still have one airplane and one engineer support. Let's go ahead. We're going to take these guys in here. Yeah, we're going to go into this clear terrain right here. He's going to flip. Ah, so he's in ambush. So my lead guy is going to get smackered. Uh, we're going to send both of these in here. Because he'll be 6-7 because of the event. Um, so he'll be 7. I'm going to be 3-4-5. Four, 4-5-6. Five, four, five, Six, seven, and then he actually. So I'm going to be a seven. He is going to be a six. Uh, let's go ahead and roll this. Ah, uh, it looks like I'm going to make it. So he is 13. I am 14. Because it's three, four, five, four, five, six, seven. 7 plus 8 is 15. Yep, so I've got it. So that is another one. So we are up to 20 supply points. Or 20 um, control markers, which is good. This gets flipped over. Oh, ambush. So it doesn't matter. He, he's gone. He, or he goes into the out of action. This guy gets spent. These guys go over here. And we are good to go there. Um, let's see here. So I have these guys here. Which I'm not a fan of moving right now. 
because I don't have any support available. So let's go back out here. So I don't have any support available here. So nothing is no support available. And next turn, these three right here will be um, isolated. So that's going to make some difference on them. Interesting. Okay. And what I really got to do is flip those over. Okay. So that's, uh, that's my movement and combat. So that's my German action, some combat phase, uh, the end phase. Um, I automatically reduce this by one. And then these get flipped. And then I move the turn here. And remember, the uh, defensive bonuses, so their thing, only happens the first time. Oh, you know what? I forgot to. I'll have to add them up here in a minute. It only happens the first time you use them. After that, the defensive bonuses don't do anything. I really would like not to roll a six for this one, so I could actually fight this one. I don't know. It keeps it's it's annoying in that case because I keep rolling a six on it. Okay, so we're good to go there. Uh, we are now in the turn five, and we're back to the beginning of the turn. Let's see here. So we it was originally nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh, let's see, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yep, so we do have 20. Okay, so now we're on to turn four. And let's go ahead and cover that up. <laughs> that The reflection off the, of that light there. Uh, that does cast a gigantic shadow. So maybe we do it this way instead. That way, yep. There we go, I like that. Okay. Turn four, so let's go as so we start from the beginning. The dawn phase. Well, we have a couple isolated here. So that one's isolated, that one's isolated. Because it is surrounded here, it cannot get to the Vogel. There's a little pincer move, and this guy's isolated. So these guys are all isolated. They're gonna that's gonna make a difference. Those are the only ones that are isolated that I can tell. So yeah, because that guy's can go there. This guy can get through here. So, feel pretty good on that one. Probably should have gone up here instead of here, but, and then that one would have been isolated too, but either way. Okay. So, withdraw random events. So, 3d6, and I get a 13. Uh, 13 is a logistical pause. I, I think they purposely do that. And I have to do six. Fudge. Okay, fudge, fudge, fudge. So one, two, three, uh, four, five. I guess we'll do this six here. Dang it. That's not what I wanted. Okay, so now we do points, supply points. That's not much. That's 11. I get 11 supply points. Oh. So 11 supply points. <clears throat> not going to get to get this back up. Um, I get my free air. Um, let's see. Two points for uh oh infantry let's no let's do this one so this is going to be two points and we're going to put them back in with his group so that's one and then two um we're going to do two, two engineering one two three four and then a whole bunch of arty because they're one, two, three, four. Oops. 
and we're gonna do five and that'll be it for the supply points okay supply phase is done this one right here is the only one that's in contest mode and two finally nothing happens oh thank god all the rest are good i don't have any other contest modes in this one okay so now we do it okay so let's go ahead and we're going to take care of this one first we are going to <laughs> i want this one done i want it done okay air support and engineer um so he has starts out with eight so he is actually at four because that's this one now this one's seven 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 11. So I have 11 and he has 4. He gets 15 and I get 16. So I just barely win that one. So that's good. This guy goes away. This one and this one go there. I add one here. My control's up to 21. All right. Okay. I don't have, I do have an engineer going into here. That'd be 10, 6, 7, 8. No, I'm going to wait to do him next turn because now he is isolated and that'll make a difference. That's going to make a difference. Okay. So let's go up here. Um, that one stays spent. Uh, this guy's isolated, so let's let's start with him because I'm going to pull these guys, move these guys into here. Uh, and in this case, oh, I don't. Oh, I do have an engineer. So we have an engineer. I do have to roll for his isolated. So three on an isolation, I believe, is nothing. Isolation three, that's no effect. So the isolation didn't have anything to do with this. So he is going to be, oh, an eight. It is an ambush. So an ambush. Lead attack unit goes away. So that's going to be one of these guys here. Um, so he has eight. I have three, four, five, six, seven. So it's all how the dice are going to roll up. You know what? Let's make it eight. Or... So I have three, four, five, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine to eight. Oh, God. So nine. <laughs> uh, so that's 15. And then he has eight and 20. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So the ambush won't matter because it says if it's a uh, repulse, you don't have to do anything. These guys are spent. It's good. These guys are used up. Okay. Now we're going to move these three into here. He's isolated, so let's go, uh, let's flip him over and find out what he is. He is a barrage. That's not good. So a barrage. The German player must either place one of the attacking units out of command or flip all attacking units spent to retreat. By the way, this guy right here, I forgot to move that down. That's not good. So uh, we're going to move them to spent. So basically they went in and they got barraged and they're like, oh, nope, 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 nope. And retreat. Yep. Okay. Yeah, because it's making sure. Yep. Reduce more L by one. Okay. Yep. Yeah, a defense strategy is only played once during the action round. 
Okay. So... Mm -hmm. Okay. Man, I wish there was like a recon. I didn't see one at least. They like can move or recon. Huh. If the active area is contested at the moment, then. Yep. Okay. All right. Okay, so I still have um, a few more I can do here. Wanted to make sure I was right here. But uh, I don't have any more engineers, so we're going to go into here for rubble. So we're going to take these guys and go into here. This guy gets flipped. Hopefully it's not a barrage. Nope. Oh, it's a new one. It's one we haven't had. It is a... Come on, focus. Anyways, it is a fanatic. So that's a new one. I haven't had a fanatic yet. So a fanatic, if the combat result is a success, it is changed to a stalemate. Ignore if the combat result was a repulse, a stalemate, or an overrun. Okay. So I have seven, eight, nine, ten, eight, or Seven, eight, nine, ten, nine, ten. Fourteen to his eleven. Fourteen to his eleven. He gets six. I get six, which means I win. But because it's a male, it becomes a stalemate. So on the stalemate, if I remember right, nothing happens. I'm just going to double check just to make sure I don't do anything. Stalemate. Oh, they just flipped to their, their, um, their sides here. Okay. Uh, here. Here and here. And these already are used. And again, this one, I am going to wait. Move them in here and take care of that one. I'm probably going to take these four and move up to here. Uh, this next turn, as long as I don't get a problem. But... That looks like everything for now. So we are end of turn. Morale goes down. I'm going to have to spend some. I still do have two arty left over. So that's good. Okay. So we're flipping all these over. So that way we are ready to go again and we can go on to turn six. Uh, yep. Okay. So turn six, dawn phase, this guy's isolated. So hopefully we'll do some stuff there. No reinforcements, no withdrawal, random event phase three. I get nine. So nine on the random event is commissars. Increase this. Oh, it's commissars. You know, they should make a little counter for that, by the way. I really think they should make a counter for that. Commissars, just to remind yourself of it at the time. Now, one thing I didn't mention here is there's multiple leftover of each of these spots. Because um, I've been keeping these. So replayability is extremely high. Okay, well, at least I don't have the logistical pause. <laughs> so that's, that, does, that does help. Okay, supply phase. Uh, 46s. Oh, good. 11, 15, so 17 points. So 17 points. Oh, good. Um... We're going to spend six points 
strictly to get this back up a little bit higher. Um, we're going to get our free air supply here. We have some arty and I've got to get one, two, three. Is that four? Four. So that's going to be eight points. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we'll flip that over. So I have three. Mm, let's do one more air, I think. Yeah, one more air, and that'll take all the supply points. So supply phase is done. Oh, I better check to make sure. So 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. And that's where I'm at. Okay, well, the nice thing is I didn't get anything. <laughs> I didn't get a, a problem with that. I didn't get the bad one. So what we're going to do, we're going to move these guys into here. He's isolated, but we're going to send in some air to help with that. An engineer unit. Now I'm not taking any risks anymore. We're going to throw an arty in there as well. Okay. So the air bore air support is minus one D six. Oh, that hit my finger. Minus one D six. Oh, it's a six. Okay. That's good. Now, so we have six, seven, eight, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 12. And he has five. So it's 12 to five. I should win this one. I might actually get an overrun on this one. So 12 to five. So I have 17. And he has seven. So yeah, that's an overrun. So this is the first time I've had an overrun, which is awesome. I set that one up really well. Overrun. So I got to read overrun. If the attack is success and the difference between the attack and defend is greater than the defensive strength of the Soviet Union, which it is overrun is cheap. Soviet unit is eliminated. Move from map. He's gone. Oh, I never did roll for the isolation. Okay. Anyways, um, I won anyway, so we would have taken that. Okay. Let's eliminate all attacking units are flipped to their spent side. So that still goes through. By the way, these guys are used. He's used. He's used. He's used. Okay. I add one here. So I have 22 now. Advance the German control markers on the record. Okay, so that basically it cancels out stuff I already knew. <laughs> well, that was, I was hoping it would, it would give me a few more. But anyways, that feels good. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take these three here. It's to go in here and this one right here to come into here. And six, seven, eight, nine. So he's up to nine. You know what? I should really just remind myself. So he is up to nine. There we go. Six, seven, eight, and then the random event is plus one. So that's a nine. I have seven, eight, nine, ten. This goes back to a nine. But back to a ten. And let's go ahead and throw an already support, support here. So 10, 11, 12, 12 to nine, 12 to nine. Here we go. Let's see how this goes. 12 to nine. Oh yes. Oh, and this is good. I think. So I have 24. Yep. I have 24. He has 15. So that's nine. So yes, the ambush doesn't count because it was an overrun. That's awesome. The ambush. That was that was a good one. That was a good time to get an ambush. Because then my lead unit doesn't get destroyed. Because an overrun can't cancel that out. Now these guys will get... Okay, things are going a little bit better now. Up to 23. 
I really need to get up to as close to 30, I think, um, as I can, because I'm a third, two thirds of the way through. And I'd like to be up to, let's see if we need 40, 30. Yeah, I don't know. We get, I've got, I got another group coming in. So that will help on that one. Okay. Oh, you know what? I forgot to do uh, bloody streets. Oh no, that's urban. Bloody streets are only in urban. And so that one didn't matter over here. Okay. It's only urban and heavy urban. Do you have to do the bloody streets? Okay. So this is actually going to be, um, I have to grab a different die here. Gotta have, okay, here we go. I'll just use this D20. So we, again, plus one. So that he's actually at a 12. So he is at a 12. So that's a 12. I know kind of hard to see. So let's go ahead and we'll zoom in on this one right here. So he is at a 12. There we go. And I'm talking about here. So he's at a 12. And the fanatic doesn't count. So what we're going to do is we are actually going to use an airplane. Uh, roll 1d6. So three. So he's actually at a nine. Uh, it's a six. There's the nine. Okay, so he is actually at a nine. So we have seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine. 10 <laughs> and yeah, let's throw an engineer support in here. 11. So nine to 11. Let's see what happens here. Oops. Nine to 11. So now that you see that I'm going to zoom back out. You can see nine to 11. So I have 11 plus seven is 18. He has nine, so yes, I do win this one, which is awesome. He goes away. And air support goes here. Engineering support goes here. And we also throw one of these up here. And he is up to 24, up to 24. And so that's that one. Oh. Yep, let's do this one. This was a barrage. He's isolated. So we're going to move back in here with these guys. He's a four, seven. He's an eight. Oh. He is an eight. Oh, here's a D12. That'll work. He is an eight. Okay, so we'll start off with an eight, but he is isolated. So we need to roll for his isolation. Higher is better. Six. Six on isolation is minus two. He's actually a six. Okay, so that's good. So six. And I have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. But it goes back to nine. But we have three, so back to ten. So six to ten up in the corner here. Six to ten. Here we go. So I'm going to win. He's got 13. I have 15. I'm starting to see a little bit more advantage. I'm starting to see some some ideas here um, with that, with this. I'm starting to get it. We're up to 25. And then all these guys are spent here. I'm out of support units. Anyways. Okay, so units I have left. I have two units here. Which... I can move it. So if it's a vacant hex, it's only one movement point. These have four. So I was thinking about going... One, two, three. And, and then, yeah, one, two, three. I can't move in here because it's adjacent and that's two movement points. So that's fine. These guys, I'm going to move these guys in here. That's two. So, yeah, these are spent. So we'll make sure so I don't get confused here. 
And yeah, so that's all my units. And that's the end of the turn. I do have to move this down. We're all down one. I didn't lose any combats that time. I'm very, very happy with that. And I'm currently at 25. I need 15 more in three turns. I think I can do it because I have the one qualifier here. So yeah, I think I can do it. I think all I need is 15 more points in three turns. So I have to do five. I have to be successful five for the next five turns. And I have do have um, some units coming in here. Uh, some reinforcements that are going to come in on here. We'll have to see how it goes. Uh, looking forward to it. Again, this part two, Stalingrad, Advance of the Vogel, 1942. Uh, I hope I got everything. I hope I try to remember everything this time. I do appreciate the comments and everything. I hope you guys are enjoying it, and I'll talk to you later. Have a great day. Bye.